All right. Now I'm gonna create the, um, oh, I knew it. Bring it more to the center too. It's always good to check the top. All right, let's bring that up a little bit more. There we go. All right. So now the outer walls. Hold on, let's see if we can do this correctly. <laughs> I know they get small from here, so we're gonna press L for loop. And hopefully pinch that so it looks smaller. All right, about there. And then we're gonna press E to extract. Crap. All right, let's extract the long. All right, just a little bit around there. Right, let's pull that this way. All right, we'll loop that. Press it again. If it goes like all across like that, just press it again. All right, let's tighten that a little bit. All right, I know he has another, like another bulge here, which seems like to go to this ball right here. All right. All right, I think we can, all right, loop that, bring that this way. All right, hold on. All right, this is gonna be a little bit tricky because the bulge is this way and that's squeezing in his little, so we're gonna to have to shape the little sack. All right, but we can work this. <laughs> All right. All right, let's push that this way. All right, it gives it that small little Loop there. All right, let's look back. He has another bulge here. Let's press loop. Bring that over here. Press E to extract. Crap, now we're going to have to. Hold on. a little bit there we go now it looks like the camera pulled in a little bit I think this one we can squeeze in a little bit Let's see. All right, his bulbous hands are around here. So I think we can delete this and then close that up. All right.
Nope, I don't think that worked well. So let's undo that. Alright. Seems like I removed the color, but that's okay. We can still work with that. All right, now to find the the area we extracted from there. There's like three extractions here. Here they are. We found it. <laughs> it was pinched between the first one. Alright, right, that looks better. Let's check that out. Alright. Right, let's loop this area, enlarge this area here. That's where his hands are going to be. We're going to do a little pinch here, but we're going to do that later. Or we can do that now. Hold on. There we go. There we go. All right. So now to build the arms around um, here. From what we see, he got three little digits coming out, so. Let's see. All right, I think these could be the, these could be his digits. Let's see. All 
All right, I think we can build his hands out of there. So we gotta check if the other side is coming out well. All right. All right. <laughs> this is my first time building. Well, not first time building a Pokemon. This is like my third time building a Pokemon. I built Mr. Mime before and Pikachu. But they always come out kind of fucked up at the beginning. And then I always get the always get them fixed at the end. Alright. Um Let's see if the The free tessellation works in um this is where Oh here we go, nice. Alright, we enter to validate and right here is where his thumb should be coming out and I totally forgot I was using two layers so let's squeeze that in press L again squeeze that in a little bit It's always good to look around. All right, so far it's looking good. All right. So far the hand looks like it's protruding out here, the finger. So let's press control, but let's face the side while we do it. <laughs> All right, let's control save. There goes his finger. All right, that's one. All right, let's fill that out a little bit. All right, it's a little bulbous, but you know. And now that's one we can do for bulbous fingers. <laughs> All right. And hopefully we can do the same thing. All right, let's check the time. Hopefully we can do the same thing with these fingers here. Um, try to see if I can free tessellate. Um, a digit up here. Hopefully it comes out on the other side too. All right, nice. I like that. Enter to validate, and then here we can get another finger. All right, validate that. So like that, we got that finger, and then we're gonna pull out this finger. Let's squeeze that in a little bit. All right, and hopefully we'll pull out this finger. <laughs> there we go. Right now they don't look like anything, but if we keep on tweaking them, they'll look like perfect arms. Let's see how that looks. All right, starting to look like him a little bit. So that's good, I like that. 